So what I want to do now is we're going to take this into prayer. And to amplify this power of we, what I'd like to do is invite any ministers in the room to stand up, any licensed practitioners in the room to stand up, and all of our practitioners in training to stand up. And let's move to the sides of the room and let's hold this community, hold this community in this vibration of we. And I'm going to invite us to all turn within, join together in this affirmative prayer. And for everyone here in this space, we know that the power of intention is activated through our yes energy. The power, that power for good that exists in the universe is activated through our yes, as John so beautifully reminded us. So if you are here in, in this moment, you are open to the power of affirmative prayer, prayer. please say yes. yes. So into this yes energy, I speak this word. I speak this word of knowing that there is only one power, one presence, one infinite allness of life, that it is everywhere present, that it is everywhere active, that it is the absolute truth of who I am. It is the truth of each person standing around this community, each practitioner in training, each minister, each practitioner who is licensed, each, each individual who knows their willingness to know God who lives in that vibration, that space, that we come together in this oneness now, in this space of this one life, this one power, this one presence, we consciously turn our awareness to this energy and I speak from this space of oneness, knowing that we are indeed one with the infinite allness of life. Each person in the presence of my voice, whether that voice be vibrating against their ear right now through this thing that is perceived as space between us, or through the digital field. That right here, right now, I know that there is a power and a presence that is revealing itself as each life in this room. That power and presence is unblockable. It is unstoppable. That power and presence is now manifesting in each life as absolute wholeness, as perfect peace that passes understanding, as the divine energy of life, of love, of creativity, of abundance, abundance in the form of divine right relationship, abundance in the form of absolute health and wholeness, abundance in the form of money, of the energetic known as money, the abundance in the form of the divine right employment, abundance in the form of love. And I know that each person here now, whatever it is that has been perceived to be a block, a lack, a limitation in their life. I know now that this word dissolves that perceived block, dissolves that limitation, simply erases it and releases it, and we bless it. We bless those so-called blocks. We bless those so-called limits. We bless those things that uh, reminded us with a knock on the head to pay attention. Look, look, practice, practice, listen, listen, align, allow. Let go. And in that release, that opening, those blocks are dissolved. So each person here is uplifted. Each person here is expanded. Each person here is deepened in their conscious awareness of their absolute divine nature. Each person here is deepened in their oneness with oneness, both the energetic awareness and this spiritual community, that each person here may individually and we collectively may be a space for transformation, a space for love, a space to reveal wholeness, a space to reveal what would love look like here? And we know that it looks like us, for that is indeed the truth of who we are in this moment, in every moment. And in the deepening of this awareness, the power of this word uplifts the lives of each family of this community, of each individual with whom any one of us comes into contact, uplifts the lives of this entity known as Columbia, as Howard County, as Maryland, as the United States as North America, as the world, we call the earth. Peace, be still. God is, we are, and all is well.
and with a joyful heart in such loving gratitude for this community, for each individual who says yes, 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 yes to love. I release this word into the law of action where it has already been received, already been made so. And it is our privilege to simply celebrate its completion and celebrate the privilege of witnessing God as each one of us. What a joy it is. We've named it, we've claimed it, we allow it to be. And together we say, and so it is.